Hello there, here with another tardigrade update for you all. In my last video I attacked some critics and uh, I would like to apologize to them. Um, it seems you were right and I, uh, I, I could have been wrong. Uh, something horrible is happening to my tardigrades. They don't seem to be doing so well at the moment. It, 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 it appears their way of living isn't sustainable at the moment. Lots of them are going into cryptobiosis, um, while uh, a, a, a few remainers struggle to stay alive, some uh, even resorting to, to eating... to eating no. Never mind that. Um, uh, sorry. Uh, what 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 appears to be happening is that due to their sheer numbers, uh, my tardigrades are actually depleting their surroundings. With their exponential rise in numbers, uh, comes the need of more food. To achieve this, they they had to expand their agricultural undertakings. They, they uh, malit uh, manipulated more and more moss and uh, didn't give the ground time to refresh. That's what happened. Uh, uh, also, um, organisms produce waste. Uh, um, um, you know, feces, urine, um, to be precise. And this made large patches of the habitat toxic for both moths and tardigrades. Um, I, I, I don't really know what to do. <clears throat> I'd like to believe my tardigrades can fend for themselves. Um, they, 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 they're much too clever for this. Or, or well, so I thought. Should I clean the habitat or see how it goes? If you put them back in the wild, this wouldn't be an issue, of course. Um, there, there's so much space for them to live and, 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 and that the ground will have time to replenish. Um, their numbers could be rising without a problem, right? But sadly, I can't let them out. The, the, the consequences could be endless. What, what impact would they have on the ecosystem? Gee, what do I do? I'm, I'm, I'm sorry guys. I'll get back to you. Bye.